Is it feeling cathartic? Yeah, yeah man, I feel great. OK, so let's see what this one represents. Um, here we are. It's fairly self-explanatory, but uh, tell us anyway. Yes. List shows. Yeah, list shows, yeah. I, I, I don't know quite why, but, I mean, we've got into this tabloid reality television sort of yeah. thing now. So and, which one uh, of these have you seen, do you think? Well, I didn't even know what this was, but... Celebrity mingers after they were mingers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but apparently... Apparently, that's ugly, is it? Yeah, that's, that's ugly. ugly. That's ugly these days, yeah. And uh, so, celebrity ugly people after they were ugly, and celebrity ugly people before they, they were ugly, ugly yeah. Anyway, they, they, you know, they just have this endless sort of top 100 yeah. worst behaved, top 100 rudest, top 100 ugliest. So it's just. So, where, what have you seen of these? Well, I mean, I must say, you know, if it's there, I'll flip through it to see what, it's, what it yeah. is. But the, the, the ugly one, I turned on, I didn't even know it was on, I just flipped through the channels and saw, you know, the 100 most ugliest people, and I thought, mm. <laughs> I'll be on that. <laughs> so, actually, I came in at 27. <laughs> no, no, I didn't come in at 27. <laughs> I turned on and it was Oh, I see. Right. <laughs> the shame is they immediately believed what you were saying. <laughs> <laughs> I turned it on yeah. at 27 and yeah. wondered whether I'd missed yeah. if I was there, <laughs> you know, or whether I had sort of whether I actually had made the top 27. But I yeah. was told earlier that I actually wasn't on the list at all, which is even more insulting. I didn't even make the top 100, <laughs> you know. <laughs> um, anyway. They've done things like here, like top 10 uh, bastards. Um, number one was Alan Bastard, the uh, Rick Mel character. Number two was David Brent. No room for Hitler. You'd have thought he'd be in there somewhere, <laughs> wouldn't you? Um, it seems a bit ridiculous. But soon they'll be doing top ten numbers, your favourite top ten numbers. In yeah. at number five, number five. <laughs> in at number four, number sixteen. You know. um, so these programmes have basically, you know, they've just got a poll, they've just basically sort of... Which is basically, what clips can we afford? OK, we'll make this the top Yeah, there's a lot of repeats. You know. I mean, some yeah. clips are worth seeing uh, again and again. I mean, there's a great one of um, Jamiroquai. Uh -huh. He's on celebrities behaving badly. They drive past, he drives past his hotel. And then you see in the distance his brake lights go on, and this little bloke gets out, runs out, says, Did you kick my car? <laughs> to this photographer. And the guy says, No, I didn't. I didn't. He says, oh, You kicked my car, didn't you? And he says, I didn't, I didn't. And then he starts having a go, and then he's got minders behind him by mm -hmm. this point. Mm -hmm. And this photographer, who just, out of character, just so sort of nuts him. <laughs> <laughs> and it's fantastic. <laughs> it is. It's, it's like, and you, you hear it, and you think, Oh, Yes! <laughs> because this guy is a real, you know, he's a real yeah. little putz, you know, and he yeah. gets out and just because someone, you know, and he didn't knock his car, he just sort of wanted to have a go. You know? Yeah, yeah, yes. OK, now, Swiss television, of course, you mentioned you live in Switzerland now. Yeah. Um, what, what's Swiss TV like? Slow. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> Well, we've got a rundown of what's on Swiss <coughs> television tonight, because it oh, may yeah. not be up to a British standard. Six o'clock, Yodel Idol. <laughs> Seven o'clock, Last of the Summer Nazis. <laughs> Eight o'clock, Barbarella, a film starring Jane Fondue. <laughs> I can't really do puns, but at, uh, <laughs> at 9.30, there's a special concert from the Swiss rapper Emin Emmental. <laughs> um, well, the Swiss television, they've got things called cow shows, is that right? Well, there is a, 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 um, a sport... <laughs> is there? <laughs> ..that involves, um... Kind of throwing cows, I think it is. <laughs> well, you grab them by the udders and swing them around. Really? <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm getting it slightly wrong here, but yeah. there's, there's, there's cows that they breed to bully the other cow. Right. <laughs> and a friend of ours has one of these cows, so I know it exists. Yes. They, they breed it to bully the yeah. other cows, and right. whoever bullies the most <laughs> wins. <laughs> okay, I've, I'll give you a little test here. I've come up with the top five common myths. This is a list. The top five common myths about, about Switzerland. Yeah. <laughs> so tell me if these are true or not. Yeah. So the first one is uh, you're not allowed to flush a toilet after 11 pm. Is that false or true? Well, you can do it in my house. I don't know anywhere else. Right, OK, but it's true. Is it really? Yeah. So you're flushing like the toilet illegally. Yeah, <laughs> illegally. I'm flushing illegally. Um, your child's name has to be on an officially approved list. I, again, I would have said no, but you're going mm. to tell me it's yes. Aren't it's you? true. Yeah. yeah, there is a... So you can't call your child Moon Unit, for example, or, you know, <laughs> oh, right. as Frank Zappa did. Um, number three, if you're found with less than ten quid on you, you can be arrested. That's true. It's false. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> It's, but it's one that's well believed. It's one that's well, well my believed. wife yeah. always tells me yeah. <laughs> that if you don't have any money on you, then that is grounds for them to arrest you on the grounds of vagrancy. Right, OK. okay. If you don't have any money on you. Mm. Um, number four, the Swiss invented a cuckoo clock. Austria? It's, yeah, you're right, it's false. It was invented in the Black Forest. Black Forest. And the fifth one, there's a section in the supermarkets just for horse meat. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Have you ever had horse meat? Not knowingly, no. No. 
But now I think about it. <laughs> <laughs> there was that sheepskin nose band I couldn't digest. <laughs> um, well, we're going to put list shows in because once we've put list shows in, then we can really get the boot into reality television, and that can go as well. So in the go, list shows into Room 101. Oh, right. Okay.